All right, this is an unboxing of Vital Proteins Collagen Peptides. This is actually my second time that I've gotten this product right here. I like it so much that, you know, I went around and got it again. Now, uh, I'll talk more about the taste and everything else, like, once I open it up. But as you can see right here, it says collagen, 20 grams of collagen per serving. It's good for skin, hair, nails, and joint support. All right. Grass-fed, pasture-raised cattle that this has come from, unflavored you know, that's big for me, unflavored. I don't like a lot of crazy flavor, so I chose to get Vital Protein's unflavored uh, version of this. I've also tried the marine collagen, which is actually tastes better than this because you really can't taste much of the marine, but it is really expensive compared to this. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the sides. On the side, it talks about the nutritional facts as well as the typical amino acid profile, all right, which is really important right there. And it tells you, gives you instructions on how to mix it. It says combine one to two scoops of uh, with eight ounces of liquid. Mix thoroughly. All right, there's a lot of information. You might want to read that once you get on there. All right, so right here just talks about what some of the claims it says. It says one simple ingredient, paleo friendly, youthful appearance, skin hydration, skin elasticity. All right, very important. Healthy joints and bones. Mix in hot or cold liquids. Now that's something I have to say about that. Uh, I'll get back to that once I open it up and start getting mix it, mixing it together. It says hair and nail support, which is also important. So to unbox this, I'm going to go to the top, and there's this little latch right here. So I'm going to take my finger, and I'm just going to go right here and just simply pull this right here and open it all the way up. All right. Open it up like that, and on the top it says vital proteins. Pretty cool. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and open up the cap. All right, open up the cap. No cap. All right, kind of tough. All right, got that off. I don't know why that was a little bit tough, but it was. And right here is a safety seal on the top of it. And I'm just going to simply open this up and peel it back. All right, so I peeled back the safety seal. And there is the powder. And I'm guessing the scoop is somewhere in there. And I don't want to get my hand all uh, collagen-y. If that's, whoa, just wasted a lot. All right, I'm just going to take the spoon and scoop out the scoop, all right? So I'm going to scoop out the scoop, all right? Go ahead and put the spoon inside the glass because it has a little bit of collagen on it. And I'm going to take the scoop, and it says one to two. And I'm going to opt for two scoops of this right here. So I have one scoop right here, and I'm going to go ahead and put one scoop in there, and then... Whoa, spilling out a lot of it. Be careful because this stuff will spill everywhere. So I have two scoops in there. All right. I'm going to push this back to the side. All right. And I'm going to mix it. And remember I was like talking about like mixing it, mixing it with hot or cold liquids. Now, my experience with this, like I said, this is the second time that I've gotten this product. Mixing it with cold liquids will leave you with a clump at the bottom and it is not the greatest tasting clump all right so i just mixed this this was like pinto warm water all right so uh it's pinto warm water so it's uh not hot not cold just pinto warm and it mix fairly well with warm water hot water definitely i've heard people mixing this with coffee and i've actually mixed it with coffee myself and it dissolves really well in hot liquids Warm liquids, okay. Cold liquids, you uh, you might run into some issues. Although people mix it in with uh, smoothies and it goes well. All right, so I mix this up and I'm gonna go and taste it. All right, so it mixed pretty well. Looks dissolved, cloudy. Uh, you might want to add some flavor to it. I'm not sure, honey or something else to it. Some people have done, done a lot of things. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this and I'm gonna tell you what it tastes like and how easy it was to go down. So let me go ahead and do that. All right, so I just drank it, and it's not the best tasting by itself, but it is tolerable. Uh, one thing that I find helpful is to not breathe in, all right? That's a trick. 
that I use to drink things like this, not to breathe in and you won't really taste it. So if you have a problem with drinking things just for what it is, I would suggest like mixing it with some sort of uh, beverage. Uh, that way it can hide the taste. It does have a slight aftertaste to it. But overall, it's not bad. I'm, I'm here for the benefits of the collagen peptides and not really for the flavor. All right, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching about this unboxing. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.